you know recently the rates of ritual the rates the rates in which uh, people private parts the rates in which people are disappearing in Nigeria now is so alarming is so alarming the way young girls young promising girls are being used for whatsoever they call ritual is so alarming it's so painful and this is the time I urge everybody brother sister uncle friends family don't ever look down on that your brother that is still hustling don't ever look down on that person because that is the main thing that is mis- making most of these people to go into this now people graduate every day people take loan to school pe- to, for schooling people do so many things while they are in school and when they come out hoping to seek a brighter future guess what they they actually go register for hairdressing register for mechanic uh, for sorry mechanic is a very though and they look out for nigeria register for this register for that just to support the the parents and whenever you are doing all this mini stuff and you come online and see how people flaunt wealth you don't even want to know how these people made their wealth you just want to flaunt wealth like them and you want them to show you the road which road are they showing you even bef- even one thing that surprises me is instead of you to go and work hard and go in fact let me just say the reasons why i'm here now these are the ways many nigerians make money in nigeria right now don't ever envy anybody you see people private parts mixing you see them yahoo you see them um performing some kind of ritual you see them doing so many dirty things there is no electricity in nigeria up nepa and down nepa there is no nothing like employment instead of the com- the government to be building companies the governments are busy um, borrowing money to pay bandits, borrowing money to maintain loan, borrowing money to, to, to enjoy themselves. You understand? So, and our parents see us as their pension because even the government don't send you. Whether you are receiving pension, whether you are dying, whether you are roasting, nobody cares. You understand so it's all man to himself so now what we, instead of the young guys to see their mom dying or that kind of thing and that's why you see the, the things you see on the media like there is no very day there is no day the one that we have seen though no, there is no day that you will see in nigeria you not see a young girl that they push out from a moving car that run mad that you not see a young boy that was killed and the private parts taken away you will not see this yahoo person do this you know so kind so many different things you will not see kidnapping like the other time i saw um what they do is they kidnap then when they kidnap they they will they will if if your if your people refuse to pay up pay up in time and everybody get money some people, people don't even have money to even eat Imagine a country where by minimum wage is thirty thousand, and a a, a painter of Gary is almost two thousand. So tell me, and electricity is up is above fifteen thousand. So how are they even coping? Is what I don't actually know. So you see them, they said after kidnapping, and after kidnapping, and your people refuse to pay on time, they will harvest your body organ, and that is another business on its own. And that is what so many rich men do. I know when they are caught, you to, when they are caught, they release themselves because they already have backup of the government and all that. You get what I'm saying? So the, the poor masses are there moving around. Once you are poor and you are kidnapped, you are dead. And your body pass is being sold as another money again, as in your body pass another money you bring cash another money so stop what i'm trying to say is stop envying most some nigerians that you see spraying money don't get it twisted so many are hard working so many are doing legit business but the ones that are into different type of rubbish 
are more than the ones that are into legit you get it so many of them are doing legit stuff but so many of them so many young guys have now joined yahoo you come out from school you know you know see work you join yahoo so many of them have joined yahoo so many of them have joined kidnapping so many of them have joined banditry in fact banditry itself is another employment on on its own so many of them have joined banditry so many of them have joined a uh, selling of human parts so just to make money to come on social media and flaunt eh? stop as in so many things that you see on social media just day your day so many things that you see on social media are actually um fake fake life is everywhere just be who you are don't envy nobody envy nobody you know what people don't know is the kind of um for those that believe in reincarnation yeah so many things that you do have so many things that you do affects affects you both physical and spiritual you get it yes you're making that money some so many times they were, they were eating shit so many of them even their annals is out of this world okay the other time um one news leak say bob riskinage they leak even in the europe here so even in the europe so many of them are actually the you both are busy doing those things to them just for them to have that money to come to Africa and flaunt Ogu China. You get so so many dirty things people do because of this particular money that when you even check it, is we wanting excess of that money that is actually leading us to this destruction that we are into. Yes, nobody just wants to have that money for basic needs. We have to want the one that we will flaunt. We want the one that we go everywhere. But we will not want to work hard like those people. Like when you go to internet now, belt, belt, Niger belt, Niger S belt, Niger, this one belt, this one belt, this one. Our youth have got, are taking belt as their own employment. Thank God for social media that have employed thousands of Nigerian youth also. Thank God for social media that have employed them. Eh? So many are doing so many things. I have I even list the drug. Have I even list different type of thing that in fact, as in I don't know, but I don't know in every household right now, I think that everybody should be praying for him or her siblings so that they will not involve this Murumini generation. I call it Murumini generation because so many things that are happening right now, and even the people that are our own, our celebrities that are even influencing, if, if even, if they even ask me to even add, eh, if I have the power, you see all those celebrities, or oh, everybody that is floating wet on social media, they should be arrested because they are they they actually are contributing to what is actually happening today. Yeah, they actually contribute because you see somebody working very hard from from month to month, year to year. The person have no hammer coming to social media. The person will not say, "Hey, look at how this person is flaunting money. I want to flaunt money like this person. I want to flaunt money like this person." And you see them doing some kind of nasty thing just to flaunt money like that person. Just to flaunt money like that person. You get it. All this, if there is, if if Nigeria is a place that when Shadinara don't even have money, so they don't even have value. Hence, they are flaunting it like that. A country where their money have value, do you think that they will be throwing it like that? I doubt. I doubt if they will throw it like that. I doubt if they will throw it like that. You come out social media, you flaunt money in a country whereby we don't even, we can't, we, they are not even proud of good water. They are not even proud of 30 minutes straight electricity. They are not even proud of employment. So many mothers can't even pay school fees of their children. So many things happening and you are busy floating wealth. You are busy coming to social media to do big boy and big girl. Why me and you know that even your pre even as you are now, you are owing a different country. You come to social media and you flaunt wealth up and down. May God help us, please. 
take notes. Stop pushing your children into the into, to the world, to, to the war or to the world. Anyone. Thanks so much, guys, for watching. Please don't forget to share the video. Bye.